Hi, welcome to Amu's area for the end of March. If it's the first time you're watching a video of mine, consider subscribing to my YouTube channel. And if this is the first video of Amina's area that makes its way to you, please consider subscribing to my newsletter so you never miss an update. Last month, I started working on a project to empower women and girls in the digital economy by increasing access to digital devices and promoting digital literacy. Even though the project was super cool, I had a really negative experience with my team and I really want to move on from that. But if you're interested in hearing more, I filmed a video about this a couple days ago and you can check it out on my YouTube channel. Ray Dalio's quote, pain plus reflection equals progress, has really helped me move on and develop anti-fragility and embrace my failures. In other news, I'm really excited about getting started with iGEM. My team has been meeting with advisors and mentors, getting a better understanding of, of how we can participate and register and what the entire experience has been like. Because we are spread out across the world, only meeting virtually, our team is quite different. Figuring out a way to make it happen, so I'm really excited. Any help at all would be greatly appreciated, from funding, to securing sponsorships, to giving feedback on our idea and helping us develop timelines. Moving on to conferences and webinars, I was able to attend Writing the Future by Twist by Science, a conference on cancer research. Next month, I hope to attend a couple more webinars, one on Canadian bioinnovation, another on proteomics, and third on university startups. Onto my recommendations, I have the trailer for In the Heights. In Amina's area of November, I recommended the In the Heights soundtrack, and the trailer was just published and the release date was just announced, so I'm really excited to watch the movie when I can. My second recommendation is a video on the replication crisis of scientific papers. I vaguely knew the replication crisis existed, I've never taken the time to think about it, and I think the video explains it really well. Next, I have an incredible TED talk. It's about the role biotech plays in shaping a more equitable future. And finally, I have the newsletter Cell Crunch, and yes, I'm recommending a newsletter in my newsletter, but I really appreciate the SynBio and biotech updates in my inbox twice a week. <laughs> The last section of my newsletter is about my goals for April. I want to film and upload weekly YouTube videos. I have so many ideas in mind, I just have to get out to filming them. My second goal is to research for and write Medium articles again, something I haven't done in a really long time. I also have a stack of books to read, so I definitely want to get to that in April. And over April break, I hope to work on some more AI and bioinformatics projects. And for EMM, the maternal health intervention I'm working on, Amongst other things, I will be completing the registration and consent forms as well as sending them out for feedback. And I cannot forget about iGEM, but I really want to register for the competition by April 30th. This brings me to the end of Amiel's area. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you have an awesome day, an awesome week, and we'll see each other soon. Bye!